The Employees tool lets you create employee profiles, assign roles and permissions, and manage employee access to your Clover devices. Let's create profiles for your staff first. In the web dashboard, click Employees, then Add New Employee. Fill out the employee name and assign the appropriate role to each person. Typically, you'll assign the employee role unless the person is a manager or an admin. The other fields are optional, but depending on how you run your business, they might be useful. Passcodes, for example, allow staff to unlock your Clover devices and let you view reports per worker. You can create your own unique code for each employee or accept the unique passcode the system assigns when you select Save. Let's move on to permissions under employees. This is a list of all the different types of activities and functions you can grant to your personnel, depending on the role. For people in the employee role to handle checkout, you'll want to give them access to register. Find Access Register in the list here, and be sure the employee role is checked for the access order's permission. When you're done, select Save. To issue refunds, click the pencil icon for that permission and select the employee role. To learn more about setting up, go to clover.com help.